We're here in Graves County getting ready to do a rabbit hunt. So I'm here with Paul. Tell me a little bit about the dogs you brought today. I got a big male, tricolored. His name's Smoke, and I got him as a pup. And then I got a little tricolored female. Her name is Tess. And then I got a, a blue tick male in here named Trump. He's only 10 months old, but he's doing really good this year. How many days a week do you usually run these dogs? If it's real hot, two times a week, but mainly two to four times a week every week. It don't matter July or August, year round. This part of the state, a lot of times you can find both cottontails and swamp rabbits. This piece of property we're on, what do we expect to find here? Mainly swamp rabbits. Okay. You got a buddy that came with you that also brought some dogs, right? Yeah. Well, let's go get those dogs out as well. All right. So, Troy, how many dogs you bring today? I brought four today. This is Echo. This is Genie. This is Festus. And this is Leon. Just a fast-footed, strong dog that's got all-day hunt, you know. Uh, <laughs> I look forward to seeing how he's gonna finish. He's doing a really good job. We've put in a lot of time to get him ready for a hunt like this. I'm excited to get out here. Hopefully these dogs get a rabbit up pretty quick. All right, here we go. They're all taking off to that one dog you just opened. Oh, they just saw it. Run over there. Let's get a move on. Here he comes, right to you, Brian. Shoot him. Shoot him, Cody. Good shot. It looks like they may have one down. Now, this is not a big swamper. This is a smaller size swamp rabbit. This right. could very easily be confused for a cottontail, but this is what we're going to be seeing a lot of today. You Hopefully think, huh? some bigger ones. You know what? They get too much bigger. Four of them turns into a load. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> well, nice job. Nice shot. <laughs> I believe you could have shot that one off the porch. <laughs> Almost did. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like there's a bunch of scat on this log. This is a sure sign that you got swamp rabbits, isn't This it? is a good sign that they're swamp rabbits. Sometimes you'll catch a big hill rabbit, jump on a stump or something and do this, but nine times out of a 10, this is what a swamp rabbit will do. You know, he tries to get up out of the water and use the bathroom. Another thing that you can look at, the rabbits that eat the bottom of the trees, the bark off the trees. This is a good sign that this place has got a lot of swamp rabbits in it. They're working it back. They went almost 600 yards and they're working their way back. Pretty big running swamper. Here it comes, coming straight to you. There it goes. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Good job, Ken. Did you get it? About time. I thought we'd start yelling the British are coming. That rabbit had a lot of heat right off the bat. You know, he was getting sight chased hard. Oh, yeah. Golly, what a rabbit. Now, there's a swamper. Well, they're finishing the track up. He killed the rabbit. We like to let them finish the track and show them it's dead before we go on to another rabbit. How far out are they, Paul? 310. 310. They're out of hearing distance, but they'd be bringing him back here in a little bit. People who either don't use electronics or they're really not paying attention to how far the dog's running on a normal cottontail, and you call them hill rabbits, right? Yeah. About 200 is kind of normal, wouldn't you say? 200 on a cottontail, yeah. If you get a hill rabbit that goes around 300, you really start thinking, you know, what's going on. About 375. Swamp rabbits, they got a lot of different advantage over a dog or a human. The cypress trees, they're hollowed out at the bottom, and they crawl up in there and you can't get them out. Rather than go into a hole, which they get might the bottom be full of, the of water, tree. they'll just go into a tree. Just anything to get a dog or coyote or bobcat off of it. Oh, they're coming back. That's what I like most about it. Whenever they pick him back up and they just start hammering, that's the best part. You see it, shoot it. There it goes. There you go. That's his first swamper. That's your first one? That was the first swamper. Fantastic, man. There it is. 
Here he goes. Oh. That one dog almost caught it. Here he comes. Here he comes, Cody. Here he comes. Here he comes. We're going to let him run. Y'all better be ready. Here he comes. Just got me a little cottontail rabbit. Shot over him a little bit the first time. Man, what a great race. That dog ran that rabbit a long way, didn't yeah, it? Yeah, probably a good three or 400 yards. Yeah, you know? for a cottontail, that was a pretty good race. But now we've kind of come out of some real thick swampy areas over yeah. here into more fields. So yeah, uh, over here, we're gonna get into more of these style rabbits. Okay, hey, nice shot. Thank you, man. Hey, we got a lot of good looking area right here to hunt. I think we're getting ready to get into it. Find him, find him, find him. That rabbit knows that it's his field all the way around it. This is a little peninsula that comes out, so he's looking for a hole to get in there, and those dogs are trying to push him. There, there he is, coming at you. Too far away. They had this rabbit in here, and that rabbit came out, but it was out of range, but I've been carrying this gun all day. It was time to shoot. There you go, get him. Go. Oh. There he goes. Hey, there's two. There's two. So I think they just got that rabbit. Someone yelled, there's two. Good shot. So I think they've got that second rabbit. It looks like they just took it. So that was great, man. I tell you what, for the dogs to get in that log jam, that's probably the safest place in this county. They got down there in the very, very bottom and bumped that rabbit out and lo and behold, jumped a second rabbit. Looks like we got shots at both of them. Man, that is some great dog work right there. Well, I'll tell you what, this was a great experience because we got to come down here today and hunt two completely different terrains that held different species of rabbits. You guys are very passionate about your dog work and today was a lot of fun watching these dogs run a lot of distance. We had a great time. Thank you guys. Thank, Thank, you. You. Thank you. Appreciate Thank you. it.